we thought we might do a bit of a QA. and a I wondered if anyone would like to ask Jane some questions. I'm sure there's a few people here just dying to go and buy 70 room chateau, clean floors and move to France. One over here. Give your microphone so everyone can hear. I want to know what happened to the chateau when you were in Paris. Oh, exactly the same as what happens when we're in Melbourne. Um, we have um, a couple that live there with their little boy for caretaking, and my dad is also there virtually full time nowadays. Um, so my mum died about five years ago, and dad came the following summer and really has never left. <laughs> came for a holiday and stayed. So um, lots of eyes and ears looking after the place, and now little dogs there as well. So um, you know, they, life goes on there. Questions? More questions? Well, we must have some questions. Can you do a team meeting there? Who's your boss? She's there. She's not here. Okay, talk. Oh, okay. You can have a business meeting there, my boss. In the dining room. How many seats at table? Twelve. It's a beautiful dining room, which you can see in the book. Six, twelve, perfect. Did you bring a lot of the Australian flavour to the French cooking, or have you just tried to capture Normandy and, and, and sort of fit with your own interpretation? Um, there's certainly a real sort of um, flavour of Normandy um, in terms of the, the, the recipes that I teach during the French table. Um, from a personal perspective, when it's just the family or with friends, um, we bring a lot of Australia to France because our French friends love um, nothing more than, you know, some different sort of uh, cuisine. And we do a lot of barbecues and, you know, <coughs> roasts and all the Australian um, cooking as well when it's friends and family. Yep. Do, you, do you have a lot of French people actually come into the Chateau to stay and do the cooking? No. No, it's mainly Australians uh, and New Zealanders. Um, now it's started to be some American people as well and um, smattering of English.